Corey Schneider, truly among the NHL's elite goaltenders. Blocked away, follow up drive by Ben Hall, a save by Corey Schneider. Every night, night in and night out, Corey Schneider's been the guy. Oh, big save by Schneider. If the Devils push for a playoff spot, the 30-year-old will be that team MVP. Sophia Yurskovich here with the profiles. Corey Schneider returns for the New Jersey Devils after backing up in a loss on Monday. In 11 career games against the Toronto Maple Leafs, he's never lost in regulation. And that's not the only reason why he's an easy guy to cheer for. Yeah, I'm going to give you one more reason to like Corey Schneider. Now, sometimes when an athlete moves teams and they move to a new city, we forget that they take their families with them. Their families have to figure out what they're going to be doing. In his case, it was him and his wife, Jill. And when they got to Jersey, Jill couldn't land a job right away. So instead of being idle, she wanted to do something useful with her time. She's very passionate about animals. So for her, that was volunteering at the local animal shelter. Now, one thing led to another, but I'm going to let Corey explain how he, Jill, and uh, the Schneiders have started a little animal shelter of their own at home. She we just got traded to Jersey, so she hadn't got a job lined up or anything, and she just wanted to do something, so she just spent her days at the shelter. Like, every day I was gone. Just walk dogs, you know, train them, help train new volunteers, help, you know, clean. There's so much that needs to be done. It's crazy, and, and how little funds they have. Jill saw the need for help at these shelters, and she took her concern home to Corey, where slowly they decided to do something about it. We fostered two that made it on his walk on so they were there were tryouts that walked onto the team we kept them you know i kind of like pretend like i'm like no we can't do it again we can't do it again and she kind of just looks at me and i just sort of you know roll my eyes and say all right fine you can keep fostering but we can't keep keeping the fosters i'm a softie so uh yeah it quickly became three cats i think at this point they have 45 cats no i'm exaggerating i'm exaggerating but it, it seems like there's an an, an never-ending flow of animals that are being sheltered and living at their house. Did you ever have anyone from any teams that you were on adopt because of you? I'm working on Kyle Palmieri. I think he's getting a lot of heat to get a dog, so we're trying to uh, work with him to maybe get him one. We've been trying to give, give him away. We've been trying to... <laughs> We were trying to hand out cats at team parties, but nobody will take them. He hosts most of the team parties at his place, so anytime uh, you're leaving, we got to be careful. There's no kittens in our cars. His teammates may not be adopting yet, but they've definitely taken to helping Corey and Jill with the cause. We've actually done a, done a couple of signings. I've grabbed a couple of my buddies, you know, Adam Henrique and uh, Andy Green and Kyle Palmieri have helped me out the last two years. We've done like a year-end signing at the shelter where a ton of fans have come through just giving all the money to the shelter so they get a little assist on that with a full-time career a growing family and already a few fosters at home permanently you might think that their ambition stops there but in fact the schneiders have even bigger plans down the road we want to try to like get a lot of land somewhere and like open almost a sanctuary for just like animals horses dogs cats maybe make some charity around it where you can you know, have, you know, uh, troubled youth or elderly or ex-cons or something come out and work with the animals to sort of help rehabilitate and all that stuff. We always feel that uh, animals and, and I think kids are sort of like the, the least advantaged or kind of get, get forgotten or don't have anybody to stand up for them often. So we kind of focus on them as much as we can.